All right, so what we're doing today, let me zoom out a little bit. I've got two lasers set up. So this is my old laser, my old Aeris is set up. Um, and and uh, this is one I've been using for a while, and it's decent at burning things, um, but not really cutting through things. Um, this is a new laser I got from Endurance uh, in Russia, and uh, it took about a week to get here, so it was pretty good shipping actually. Um, and what I, so what I've got set up is I've got them both focused on this area here, okay, and I'm going to burn a circle or I'm going to cut a circle out of this cardboard and I want to see which one's basically faster. Now I know this one's going to be faster, um, but how much faster is it really going to be? Um, and so this is the 7 watt, like I said, this is 7 watt, um, which is probably more like 3.5 watt. This one is uh, sold as a 10 watt laser, um, and so we'll see see how much better this one actually is. Um, and I'm going to be turning this one on and off manually, um, and the, the computer controls this one. Now, once everything, obviously, uh, I'm going to be putting this one in place and wiring it all up for this one. But there's a whole lot more involved. It comes with a little air compressor for the air assist. Um, and uh, this one I can, I'm using an air compressor for the air assist. Um, so either way, both have air assist. Uh, we're gonna, I've programmed a circle to cut out and I wanna see uh, how much faster this one cuts it out. All right, hopefully that makes sense. Um, so without further ado, let's get my air on. My laser on. I think we're ready to go. Let's go to zero. Uh, we're in the middle. Get my goggles on. And then I'm going to start the job and I'm going to turn on the laser. Maybe one pass. The other one's starting to get through now. Five passes for six. I lost count. This one's nearly all the way through. I mean, that's 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 about as through as, as I could ever get with that one anyway. A um, couple more passes, that would have been all the way through. So, but, but the difference is, I think too, like this one has some some charred edges, and um, and this one's just it seems to be a little bit more cleaner. Uh, to me than, than this one. But not, I mean, again, it's cardboard, so. Um, now, to be fair, this air assist isn't pointing down nearly as good 
as as this air assist. This air assist is coming out, it's coming straight down at a better angle than this air assist. But this this one you have to focus so close that I could never get the air assist in there just right anyway. So anyway, I think that um, that proves number one that this is definitely a lot more powerful. Um, I'm going to turn this off. So this one's definitely a lot more powerful. Uh, it cut it out in one, maybe two passes. And if I slowed it down, maybe just a hair, it would definitely cut it out in one pass. Um, and this one was at about seven or eight passes and hadn't quite gotten it all the way through. Um, so, I mean, it, this is definitely a more powerful laser than the, the seven watt um, that you can get uh, from anywhere else. All right, so I think that's it. That's, uh, that's the video so far, as far as the endurance laser goes. I'm super happy with it. Um, it was easy to set up. He, he gives you these little tubes and everything, um, safety glasses and all this other stuff that tells you the, 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 um, the voltage going to the, to the diode and then this little box that has focus and PWM button on it and what mode you're in. It also has an Arduino port if you're controlling this from Arduino. I'm going to hook up these wires, which are PWM or TTL. Um, so the computer will be controlling this box. Um, and so I have to figure out how I want to wire everything. And, uh, and so for now, I'm going to keep it just kind of loose like this. I may go ahead and start hacking these wires and get the TTL side of these out so that I can wire it up and have it controlled right away so I can start playing with cutting some plywood. Um, and then I'll videotape that and see how well we do cutting the plywood. Um, but that'll be for another video once I get all this all uh, a little bit more organized. I just wanted to see initially if this guy was going to be more powerful than my old laser. Alright, that's it. Thanks for watching.